Uh, Mr Arnott, please. Deputy President, this has all been a bit of a mess from start to finish, hasn't it? We had the vote cancelled last time because of the sheer number of amendments. We then cancelled uh, the four-hour debate, rescheduled it for a busier time, squashed it into an unrealistic timescale and prevented any interaction between speakers. Then we still voted on the same amendments because that pretext was no more than an excuse to stifle debate. Millions of European citizens made their voices heard on TTIP and we chose in this place to squash debate rather than hold it. I believe that is a disgrace. We then watched a string of amendments to make the text less bad were voted down. We saw the amendments to remove ISDS altogether ignored because the President of the Parliament chose to ignore the rules and to consider a different amendment first. Well, welcome to the European Union. If you want to know why UKIP believes these structures aren't fit for purpose, this behaviour here isn't the exception, but sadly the rule. I'd vote for free trade, but TTIP is not free trade. It's a corporatist trade deal, and that's why I voted no.